Hi everyone, I'm Mary Mancusi. You might know me as the author of the Blood Coven Vampire series or Gamer Girl or a slew of romances. But um, today I'm here to talk about Scorched, my new series. It's Terminated with Dragons. It comes out in two weeks and I'm so freaking excited. Um, I know you've probably heard a lot about Scorch at this point, and especially uh, talk of the cover. So today was a special day for me because I actually got to see the cover and the entire book in real life. That FedEx package came with the first copy hot off the presses. Now I don't care if it's like your first book or your 17th book like Scorch is for me. There is something magical, magical about getting that book and holding it in your hands for the very first time. Uh, and just It starts to feel really real, you know? And so I wanted to share that with you. Uh, and this one's really special. Okay, so here we go. Yay, Scorch! It's my book. Um, this is only my second hardcover, so that's really particularly exciting to me uh, to get the hardcover release. Gamer Girl was my only other hardcover. And um, the cover on this one is just so gorgeous. I mean, it's a work of art. The artist was Tony Sahara, and he outdid himself. I mean, if you look at it, Here's a big dragon. I mean, what could be awesomer? You know, I love dragons. I've always loved dragons. And to have a book, um, I think I said in some blog entries before, you know, Robin McKinley's Hero in the Crown was one of my favorite books growing up, and there was this huge dragon on it. And if I had been able to tell my, you know, fourth grade self then what I know now, um, I would be pretty excited. So uh, I love Emmy. I love her blue eyes. You know, she's described as green, you know, emerald green with blue eyes, and I think they did a great job. Um, I love the heroine, Trinity. Uh, she just looks great. She looks totally badass, and, and she is. She's no damsel in distress, definitely. Uh, and I love all the violence in the background. Everything is literally on fire. It's scorching, so that's really cool in of itself. And I think it's a cover that would appeal to guys and girls, which was important to me because I do feel like this book uh, would appeal to both. It's not a simpering romance type book. Uh, not that there's anything wrong with that, but this book just is not that. I mean, there's a lot of action. There's a lot of dragons. Uh, there's a lot of violence <laughs> uh, in addition to any romantic elements that are in the book. Anyways, so this book is cool in of itself. It has some cool little features. Um, you know, like, as you can see, the actual... Uh, what do you call this? UPC or whatever uh, barcode. It actually has fire. It's scorching <laughs> or it's on, you know, it's smoking. So that was really cool. But um, there are some interesting touches of this book that aren't apparent to the first eye. So inside the cover, they also colored it and you can't see all the detail um, on screen, but it really is beautiful. And it kind of looks, you know, almost Dr. Whovian, like you could expect the TARDIS to be flying through this at any moment, which I love because I'm a total Dr. Who geek. Um, but even this is not the coolest part of the book. Uh, when I got the book in the mail, there was a note that said, you need to take off the jacket. And so I did. And I will do that now. And when I did, <gasps> there's an Emmy on the book. Ah! Isn't that cool? Oh my gosh. And if you could feel it, like seriously, one, it has this really soft touch to it. Um, it's just like almost velvety soft or satiny soft. And um, the dragon is embossed. So like you can feel every scale on Emmy as you run your fingers down it. I'm talking like you can literally pet the dragon on the book, which is funny because in the book, you know, we talk, or Tr Trinity talks about Emmy's soft scales. Um, and you can actually actually feel them and <laughs> you can actually pet her just like Trinity does. So yeah, um, one reason not to buy the ebook. <laughs> uh, not that I have anything against ebooks. I love ebooks, but in this case, just having this like in real life and feeling it, being able to pet the dragon is just the coolest thing ever really. Um, so yeah, and it, it continues on to the back. You can see some other elements of her, her wings and everything and her legs. And so yeah, um, super excited. <laughs> Can't be more excited. I just want to hug it. <laughs> Okay, so yeah, uh, thank you. <laughs> Enough geeking out here. I wanted to also remind you while we're here, uh, you may have seen stuff on this on the internet as well. Um, Sourcebooks is offering a special deal that if you pre-order the book by September 2nd, you can get a dragon pendant uh, for a necklace. And I haven't put this on a chain yet, but they did send it to me, and it's so pretty. I wish you could see more detail. Um, you know, there you go. Uh, and it's a great size. I thought it was going to be small, but it's actually perfect size for a necklace, so people will notice it, and it's super cool. So the way you do that is basically you just um, buy pre-order the book. You can pre-order the ebook or the hardcover. Either way, you can do it from any retailer, whether it's Amazon or your local independent bookstore. 
wherever, uh, wherever you buy your books, and you send an email once you got it, uh, once you made the pre-order, to teenfire at sourcebooks.com. That's teen, like T-E-E-N, fire at sourcebooks.com, and uh, send them your receipt. You can just take a photo on your iPhone or whatever and email it to them. So it's super easy, and you get jewelry in a book, and like, what could be better? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it's all dragons here all the time. As you can see, I got my little pets behind here, my little amuses, and uh, my little dragon egg. This is Emmy hatches from an egg in this book. So yeah, um, thank you for the, sharing that with me. <laughs> I'm still super excited, and now I get to actually write the second book, but um, I just wanted to share the excitement. So thank you very much, and I hope you like Squash. I can't wait to hear what you think. Bye.